Zarkizer. Hey guys, it's your boy Zarkizer, and today we're going to talk about the new 2020 KTM RC390. The KTM RC390 is a sports bike in its purest form. It's fast, agile, and extremely sporty. Whether you're on country roads or the racetrack, the Moto3 racing jeans are noticeable in every maneuver and convey a pure race feeling, once again proving that good things can come in small packages. This is the first motorcycle I've ever owned and I absolutely love it. I got the 2017 version and I was the first in Canada to get it as soon as it was available. The RC390 is extremely gorgeous and super sporty. It has spectacular handling, incredible performance, and thrilling power. The RC390 is arguably the class leader in small capacity sport bikes. For 2020, the new KTM RC390 has a price tag of $6,150 and is available in a black and white color scheme with orange accents. There's a lot to learn about this bike, but before we get into that, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and subscribe to this channel for more daily motorcycle news and reviews. Leave a comment down below letting me know what you think about the new KTM RC390 and also give this video a thumbs up if you like it. You can also follow me on Instagram where I post daily motorcycle content and definitely check out my online store where you can buy some cool motorcycle accessories and apparel. Alright so yeah, let's get right back into it. The KTM RC390 has a dry weight of 149 kilograms and a fuel tank capacity of 9.5 liters. It has a seat height of 820 millimeters and a ground clearance of 135 millimeters. The KTM RC390 has a 373cc liquid-cooled single-cylinder four-stroke engine. This bike has a six-speed transmission gearbox and produces 41 horsepower and 26 foot-pounds of torque. The KTM RC390 has a top speed of over 104 miles per hour and can very much be ridden on the highway. It's fast, but it also delivers power where you want and when you need it most, making it an ideal bike for cruising around the city. The sporty bodywork, foot pegs, and control levers not only provide a unique super sport look, but also helps the RC390 master extreme cornering with greater lean angles. Highly sophisticated electronics also enhance the capabilities of the RC390. The high-end technical features of this bike include slipper clutch, ABS, and a ride-by-wire throttle system for smooth acceleration. A digital LCD display has everything you would expect from a state-of-the-art KTM motorcycle, including fuel gauge, engaged gear, and service reminder information. It also comes with an RPM alert to indicate the optimum moment for upshifting, just like they have on Super Sport racing machines. The RC390 sits on 17-inch alloy wheels and has high-quality suspension from WP and a high-tech braking system from Brembo. The powerful twin headlight provides excellent visibility in low light or dark conditions. This bike is extremely gorgeous and super sporty and I absolutely love it. The only complaint I have about this bike is at nighttime when one of the headlights are on at a time. I've had so many people think the headlight was broken and ask me why there's only one headlight on. I'd always have to explain that one light's for the high beam and the other's for the low beam. I would honestly prefer if both lights were on at the same time. It would look so much better and avoid confusion. Have you ever had that happen to you? Let me know down below in the comment section if you've ever had people ask you why you only have one light on. Isn't it so annoying? Let me know down below. So yeah, that's about it for the new 2020 KTM RC390. Be sure to leave a comment down below and let me know what you think about the bike. Do you like the new style and design? Do you think this bike is worth the price tag? Do you even like KTM motorcycles? Let me know your thoughts down below. I respond to every comment, so definitely let me know down below in the comment section. Also, if you haven't already, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and subscribe to this channel for more daily motorcycle news and reviews. And also give this video a thumbs up if you like it. You can also follow me on Instagram where I post daily motorcycle content. Alright, that's it for now guys. See you tomorrow. Peace. Zarkizer.